Now I will show you its bone window. This is the left transverse process of CV1. This is structured here. On right side, there is fracture of the anterior part of right second rib here. This one. On left side, posterior ends of left first rib. This one. This one is the second rib which is fractured. This is there is overlapping. Posterior end of third rib is fractured and the posterior end of the fourth rib is also fractured. This one. Now please note this area of increased tension here in the anterior segment of right upper lobe. This one here. This one. These are the lung contusions. There is increased density of lung in the posterior dependent parts of the both lower lobes. This is suggestive of effects of hypostasis. This is pleural effusion on left side here. There is no injury of mediastinum. There is no injury of clavicles. But there is fracture of the lower part of scapula here, this one, at this level. 